This DI that I'm about to share with you today is one that um, I'm wondering why it took me so long to actually try it. Because it's probably, I think, one of the more versatile DIs on the market, if not one of the most versatile DIs. Now, I use the Fishman Aura all the time, okay? I've, that's kind of been my mainstay. But it works in lots of situations okay. All right, it sounds pretty good. I, I enjoy it. I have enjoyed it. This DI is extremely dial inable, which is an official term. Uh, and this is the LR Bags Venue DI. Now, this DI is, uh, it really, they, I think they thought of everything here. Uh, let me first say this. Uh, it has a four band EQ. You've got your bass, low mid, high mid, and treble. And along with just having control over the low and high mids, those are actually, you can tune the high and low mids. So if you're getting some gross rumble down below, uh, you could actually tune to a lower low mid and, and get that out of your signal or same thing with the high mid. If you want a little bit of extra boost in kind of that 1K to 2.5K range, you can do that as well. It's got an easily controllable gain on the front, feedback notch filter, and I've used this at five gigs now. And this notch filter has saved my butt because I've actually been plugging my uh, Martin HD35, which generally has some pretty uh, high likelihood of feedback. I'm using that with a K and K pickup, and this notch filter has made it just a dream, uh, including an uh, onboard phase switch, which also is a great way to extinguish feedback. Uh, if you're using 9 volt batteries, you can actually check the battery here. You've got a, a monitoring a, a meter right there, which is awesome. Overall volume. The back, you've got an XLR out, ground lift switch. You can control the boost. This has a foot switchable boost. So if you're flat picking, you can actually engage it and it'll boost your volume. So your, your single notes will be heard over a band or another acoustic guitar player. Uh, and it has an onboard tuner. And I save this to last because I gotta be honest, I love the Fishman Aura. I think it's, I think it's a swell unit. I, I have enjoyed it. I've used it for three or four years, maybe even more. But the tuner on it is just, it's, it's abysmal. Um, and I'm not, trying to, I'm not trying to slam it, because again, I've used it for so long. But the tuner is just, it's slow to read and it's not accurate on the Fishman Aura. On the Bags Venue DI, this tuner is one of the best onboard tuners that I've seen in a DI. Now, I still use my Boss tuner because I, I'm just a creature of habit. But I will say that I'm pretty pretty pleased with the tuner on board this particular unit. Most times with a, a DI with a tuner, it seems like they, they kind of throw a tuner on there because it should be on there, not because it's going to work necessarily good. But this one works, works very good. Uh, so I'm happy about this. Now I'm going to plug this in or rather play through a little bit just so you can hear it. Uh, now I'm using uh, a Martin OM Custom here with maple back and sides, and I'm using a DiMarzio Black Angel pickup, just so you kind of know. But I've been using this with a variety of pickups and it's really easy to dial in your sound. Let me do that lick with the boost on so you can, so can kind of hear how much it boosts the, the actual signal. And it's just a, I mean, overall, having that power at your feet is incredible. Being able to boost it, having that much EQ is outstanding. Because a lot of times, you know, whether you're playing, you know, at a gig, right, you, you can't yell at the sound guy every song and be like, hey, can you tweak the low end? This gives you the power. Uh, also, if you're using it at home, I mean, if you just want to boost your signal a little bit to just get that live feel at home, practice for an open mic or something like that, this is a great unit. Um, get used to using that boost. Overall, super versatile. So I want to thank LR Bags for sending that out for review, and uh, also thank them for making just a damn good DI. Uh, it's rugged as hell. It's I mean it's it's super sturdy, and the feet on it, it's kind of got this this no slip rubber grip, which is nice uh, because it doesn't slide around when you're actually trying to use those foot switches. So overall, uh, check that out if you want to learn more about the LR Bags Venue DI. Go to AcousticLife.tv forward slash at65. There's actually going to be a link, a purchase link, if you choose to uh, to purchase this DI. And remember, any of those links that you use on AcousticLife.tv, those are referral links from Amazon. We get a percentage of that sale and we go ahead and pass that percentage directly on to Guitars for Vets as a donation on behalf of all of the guitar geeks that watch Acoustic Tuesday. So make sure to check that out, learn more about it. And if it sounds like something that could help your uh, live playing rig or just something, your general guitar rig, please consider it because I think it's something that uh, you'll find extremely useful as, as I did.